our goal is to build a platform that can help uh, solving the issue of counterfeiting and fraud in premium goods. In premium goods, how did you start the business? What led you into the world of blockchain and uh, premium good verification and authentication? I was working in the corporate world as an executive for uh, almost 20 years. And uh, I was basically uh, to facing three types of problems. Uh -huh. So one problem is uh, counterfeiting of goods. Second problem is product di diversion. And the third problem is the lack of data from consumer integ integ integrated in producer database. And my last role in the, in the corporate world was head of innovation. Uh -huh. and, uh, At I which company? In uh, the Honeywell. Hon Honeywell, okay, yeah. 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 And uh, I saw the possibility uh, of, of uh, using Internet of Things and blockchain to solve these three headaches uh, for which I suffered uh, for 20 years in my life. And what sorts of products are you authenticating now? Yeah. So our first uh, uh, vertical is uh, Fine Wines, which is a vertical that suffered a lot for, uh, from uh, counterfeiting. So eight, it is estimated that $8 billion every year are, are uh, lost in fine, in fine wine because counterfeiting. All my first memories are, are related to, to wine. I mean, uh, I remember... So you started young, is what you're telling me. That's correct. So my first uh, supervisor role was uh, when I was three, three uh, years old, and I was uh, helping my, my parents in our, our uh, uh, winery in the north of Italy. Okay, so as, as someone who's a, a, a supervisor of a vineyard at three, what exactly are the, the roles and responsibilities that a three-year-old has in a vineyard? I would be drinking, probably, but I mean, what, what were you up to? <laughs> well, uh, mostly making a mess and, uh, you know, uh, and getting dirty, yes. So uh, how is the, the solution that you've got um, differentiated or better than sort of something off the shelf that someone could get from IBM or one of the other big vendors that are now making the push into blockchain technologies now? Yeah, so uh, it's a very good, good question. So I hope so. <laughs> I try. So basically, I mean, uh, on this type of solution, uh, on, on blockchain-based solution for supply chain, the problem is never the blockchain. So it's always the element, the source of input uh, that is integrated with, with uh, the blockchain is, it, it itself. And what we use is a special type of solution, is a proprietary solution that combine uh, near-field communication tags that can sense if a bottle is closed or open. And, and how does that then work from uh, monetization? How Are you selling it as a service to, to customers? How many do you have initially? Yeah. There are basically two models. So, so, so one is a fee per, per product, but in uh, 2020, we are also launching a marketplace uh, that is going to be the most counterfeit proof uh, uh, direct to consumer online marketplace for wine. And we will have a fee. What's the website for that? The marketplace? What's it going to be? Oh, it's going to be part of Acatena. Our okay. yeah. Well, then I'll be shopping there next year. Thank you Super. so much, sir. Okay. Appreciate it. Thank you it. very much. Bye.